everyone. This is April O'Neill live at Sci-Fi Valley Con. Look who I'm talking to, Townsend Coleman. What? <laughs> no, it's not you, you, you. Yes, it's me. Best known as the voice of Michelangelo. We also the Tick, Waldo. How are you doing today? Do you have a good time so far? I'm doing great. This is a great con. Yeah. Really been looking forward to coming to this. We're really happy to have you guys with us today. And I do want to note, the turtle panel is Saturday at 4.30 p.m. You're not going to want to miss that. Having all four together, this is going to be an awesome panel. Yeah. So you're Michelangelo, but you're also credited as an alternate for several other characters throughout various episodes. I think you were Shredder for a bit <laughs> and Krang, right? Yeah. Who is your favorite alternate character to voice to fill in for. You know, I, I would say it would have to be Shredder. <laughs> He's maybe <laughs> or, or Splinter. Or, you know, yeah, Splinter but uh, but too. I do but I do have to say the only reason I did those was because the uh, various actors happened to be on vacation, you know, and couldn't make the recording session. So all I was doing was just dummying in their lines, having no idea that my version was actually going to go to air. I thought that they were going to bring back uh, the original actors to revoice those lines. Oh, and that's they, too funny. And, they and, it was, yeah. and then you hear it, and it's And then you. I hear it, and I'm like, oh, my gosh. It's like when I did Krang, it was just the worst. So, <laughs> so yeah. Well, I thought you did a great job. <laughs> well, thank you. So as we all know, the Ninja Turtles, especially Michelangelo, they love their crazy pizzas. But yeah. what are your favorite pizza toppings? You mean mine personally your, or Michelangelo's? Your personal favorite. Oh, Townsend Coleman's favorite. Yeah, <laughs> you know it's pretty boring. It's just it's got to start with extra cheese. Obviously. Yeah, mushroom sausage, onion, and black olives. That's actually that's yeah that's my kind of pizza right there. But Michelangelo's is anchovy and hot fudge. Oof. Do that. Oof. No, it's the best. One. Are you kidding me? One. Maybe throw some guacamole and marshmallows on there. Then we'll, then we could, can talk. Could be. So, this is a great week for you guys to be here because the video game Shredder's Revenge just released yesterday. Yesterday, I and know. you guys all reprised your voice. That's right. You know, what was it like to step back into the shell? And oh do my that gosh, again? it was the best. When they called us and, and booked us for that session, we were all super excited because we've never gotten the chance to voice any of the video games ever. So, this is the first time they actually used our original voices for a video game. It's Awesome. <laughs> yeah, and, and it just came out yesterday, but apparently the reviews are, are like crazy off the charts. That's, I haven't had a chance to play it yet, but I have friends that have, and they're all saying it's fantastic. It's, it's, yeah. It feels like an old arcade game right. based off the old series. You right, know, exactly. Yeah. But it's 2022, and it's it's just, we right. love that nostalgia, you I, know? This is, this is one of, you know, this is one of people's favorite shows growing up. What was the first cartoon you remember making an impact on you when you were a kid? When I was a kid? Um, I would say probably any of the Looney Tunes uh, uh, characters. Yep. I, I, used, I used to love the Roadrunner. Um, <laughs> and uh, yeah, you know, uh, Warner Brothers, uh, Hanna-Barbera cartoons. Um, I loved Huckleberry Hound. Oh uh, my gosh, yes. Yeah. Oh, that's an <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so it was that era. You know, sort of giving away my age here, but. No. Uh, <laughs> so, what, are you working on anything now? Are there any upcoming projects we can look to see you in or no, hear you in? <laughs> no, you know what? I, I'm like one of the old guys in the business. Well, so Shredder's I'm, Revenge is the new one. That's the big. What's that? <laughs> Shredder's Revenge, the video Shredder's game. Shredder's Revenge, the one, right? Right there, the yeah. Game. And I actually have some other video game uh, stuff coming out that I can't talk about. Oh, uh, those NDAs, right? Right now. But so there but, is something coming. So right. There, right. there might. Talk about it. There <laughs> might be. Yeah. Um, but no, you know, years ago, in, in addition to the um, animation that I've done, uh, back in 1993, long before you were born, um, I, 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 I'm 92, but thanks. I, oh, so you're a year old. That's great. But I, I fell into doing uh, network TV promos, and I became the comedy voice of NBC. Uh, for their must-see TV campaign. So I did all the promos for Seinfeld, Frasier, Friends, Mad About You, all the way up through 30 Rock in the Office um, for 16 years. And I voiced the promos for uh, Jay Leno on The Tonight Show every night for 16 years. So promo has largely been my life. And um, I ended up over at uh, ABC after that and then Fox after that. And, uh, and then for 17 years voiced the promos for live, what's now live with Kelly and Ryan. But it used to be live with Regis and Kelly, and then it was live with Kelly and Michael, and everything. <laughs> so all those shows. Yeah, so I've been doing a lot of promo work. So you've been doing this for a long time. If you could give one piece of advice to your younger self, what would that be? 
uh, uh, keep, keep, keep after it. You know, go after your dream. It, you know, you know that you've got a talent for this and you love it. Um, don't let anything stop you. That's yeah. great advice for anything. Right? It, it really yeah, is. Not, yeah, yeah. yeah. But it's the people who, who refuse to take no for an answer. You know, and they just figure out a way. You figure out a way. You, you know, you just, you can't see yourself not doing it. Yes. You know, and, and. This uh, is who you are, right? <laughs> and, and that's right. You know, and so here, yeah, here I is. Thank you so much for your time. Of I really appreci appreciate you being here and of, talking with me. Of course. Again, don't miss the turtle panel, 4.30 p.m. Saturday. It's going to be awesome. Be there or be square. All right. <laughs>